So you can also use the power of the internet to personally connect with your partners and customers and prospects. We have all these mass marketing technologies like email and social media, but still one of the best ways to communicate with people is to go directly to them, to, to email them, text them, call them. So a great way, great place to start is to ask for referrals from your existing clients. So just email them and say, hey, you have got some space in my schedule. I'm looking for new clients. Do you know anybody who might benefit from my product or service, right? You could offer referral discounts in in that same vein. So say if you're a personal trainer, somebody's paying you 100 bucks a month to train them, uh, you can tell them, hey, I'll give you $20 off every month if you bring me a new new customer. That can be a great way to go. You also want to be asking all of your clients and your customers for testimonials and reviews. Now, I would start getting reviews on Google because that's going to help you show up better on Google search and in, in that Google Maps uh, three pack. But you can also gather reviews on whatever platform makes sense for your business. So if you're a hotel, it's probably great to get reviews on TripAdvisor and you can start, you can start there. If you're a plumber, maybe you check out House. You can also try one-to-one -one marketing. So for online businesses, that might mean sending personalized birthday coupons to customers on their birthday, um, recommending them products similar to ones they've already purchased, or you're displaying different landing pages to website visitors based on actions they've taken. All that stuff can be a little more technical in, in terms of setting it up. Um, but basically the idea is personalizing your business interaction to the individual um, to make them feel more valued and more special. And the way to do that is to actually think they're special and value them as a customer. Okay, and then finally, number 30, you could find partner businesses. So for example, I run a web design agency. So one way that I could do that would be to reach out to social media marketing agencies and video production agencies and say, hey, um, I have a lot of clients who might need your video services. I'll send them your way. But in exchange, would you be willing to send clients who need websites my way. I can be a preferred vendor for you. We can work together on projects and we can both grow that way. I have uh, a handful of partners that I that I work with like this pretty pretty informally and um, it's really a great way to get to get leads. Everybody can sh essentially share clients and um, you can build your network like this too. So um, definitely worth worth looking into partner agencies and partnering with other companies who are servicing the same clients, but not with the exact same service, obviously.